what's good y'all so yeah i ain't been recording like all week it's sunday really there ain't nothing been going on like i got sorry so my flip camera i have the g7x and the flip part that like the viewfinder part the camera view like thing is missing a screw i wish i could show y'all and it make it make sense maybe i'll take a picture and y'all can see but the screw part came out and now it's kind of like uh, ghetto very ghetto so anyway um we're on the way to church it's sunday then but yeah y'all so we're on our way to church um we're also gonna be going over to the lawrence's house in lawrence house because we're getting their old crib for baby girl because their daughter cameron y'all saw cam um she never slept in it so it's pretty much brand new crib so i was like yeah we'll take it like what you mean so we'll do that but that's kind of like the end y'all know i end vlogs on sundays so this is the end we will start a new vlog tomorrow a new weekly vlog i don't know what y'all gonna see because y'all see what i see during these weekly vlogs and i don't know what y'all gonna see but yeah so that'll be exciting and yeah i'll see y'all at church y'all it's so hot out here so it's after church church was really really good um pastor talked about like pastor talked about um trials and tests and like how god the difference between a test and you know god sends tests but the enemy sends trial no the enemy sends temptation or whatever and you'll be tested with the same thing like whatever god's trying to teach you and that's what this literally felt like like literally before we even got to church the cooling light went on it's like oh oh we got in the church when we got to church that's exactly when it came on and the pastor preached or whatever and that's y'all we've been going through so many tests but we're not gonna complain because they're making us better they got so much better um yeah so so i'm thankful for you know my laws because y'all these tests We gonna get through it though. Like I said, we still supposed to pick up the crib. They putting the cooler in the car right now. Um, but we are supposed to go get the crib. We're not that far from Lawrence House, y'all. It is hot. We got the windows down. Cause he putting the cooler in, but. I really want babe to put it up tonight because y'all we literally only have a few weeks at this point we only have a few weeks she can come between yeah we only got a few weeks baby fit the year it's crazy so if you want to buy anything for her registry from her registry please feel free if the link is down in the description box we would appreciate you if you do see anything from the registry uh, make sure that you have like a note or something on it so i can thank you um because you know amazon i just don't like the way they do things if you don't send a note or put your name on it like i won't know who it came from so you don't at least like reach out let me know i won't know um but yeah so he's done doing that and yeah let's go because i'm hot I'm so hot. You used the whole thing? Mm-mm. That was good. Because um, they had a line. I don't know if you're supposed to pass that line. I'm going to check later. But it's, it's, it's better than what it was before. Okay. That's fine. What's good, y'all? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Taryn J. And this is Life as Taryn J. So, 
Yeah, it's, it's Monday morning. It's early. It's, it's not even 6.15. That's how early it is. <sighs> Y'all getting these kids up to school. It's ghetto. I literally had to get up at like 5.30. Because I be tussling with Bailey for a good like 15-20 minutes. If I had to get up. So... In order to do that, I gotta wake up earlier. Y'all kids just get up. Like, let me know. Let me know if y'all kids make it easy for them, for y'all in the morning. Or they make it ridiculous for y'all. Because my child is not a morning person. The earliest that she just gonna wake up is like, probably 8. <laughs> probably just 8 o'clock. What do you think before that? That's not Or it's gonna happen when it don't need to happen. It's like, girl, go to bed. So, um, yeah, I'm going to drop her off at school, and then baby and I are going to my glucose test. Glucose test. Yeah, just the thought of it is disgusting. Like. <laughs> I've been dreading this day. Like, I want to get it over. I'm so happy it's about to be over. Like, I'm doing it and I'm going to get it over it. But. Disgusting. So. Um, yeah. That's what I, we have to do. And then, of course, I have to get my labs done because <sighs> it's the last week of. My first, my second trimester. So, by the time y'all see this, obviously, I will be in my third trimester. trimester. Um, yeah, and it has to be done this week. So, getting it done. <sighs> y'all, I'm tired. I'm really tired. But, and I have to fast. So, I can't drink nothing. Like, I can't have no coffee. I don't even have coffee, but if I wanted coffee, I can't have no coffee. I can't have no orange juice. I can't have nothing at all. So, <sighs> y'all, baby girl was just rumbling last night. Like she was just like, uh, uh. I'm like, what you you boxing in there? Like you break dancing, girl? What's, what's good? was good like you you good though right so that was that was like funny i actually caught her on camera so i remember it started it's it's right here i caught her moving on camera which i've only caught bailey moving once ever when i was pregnant with her which i didn't really i don't know i was like i was 20 in 2020 no, 2015. I was only 20. So, that just didn't ding, you know? But anyway, got baby girl moving. So, that was so cool. So cool. Because usually I don't catch her. Like, she'll move, but I don't catch her. Or I'll see it, and then she won't do it again. I think because I'll be having a flash on or whatever, but yeah. Be but yeah, yeah, so that's what we're gonna do today is my doctor's appointment. And that's kinda it. That's all we got. That's all we got. So I'll see y'all. Record. You gotta talk. You gotta record. What you want me to say? Mm. It's it's your podcast. <laughs> <see back. laughs> your vlog. <laughs> I already did the intro. So you can just see I'll talk to them. Like what's good, y'all? Yeah, yeah. You gotta hold it. You gotta hold it. You got big hands, so this shouldn't be difficult. Hold what? The back. So it don't fall. There you go. I'm in the passenger seat. No, you didn't even tell him what's going on. You uh, didn't give no description. 
You just went in and I'm in the bathroom. Uh, you say you gave the introduction. No, yeah, the introduction. Good morning, it's Monday. Uh, well, <laughs> now uh, you can tell what we about to do. Uh, we about to go to the doctor's appointment. Hold on, what we doing? <laughs> We, we, about to go, we about to go to the third trimester testing. I'm in the passenger seat. Whatever. She finally driving. Boy, I drove some yesterday. Did I not? I drove some. And I be taking baby to school and pick her up. Do I not? Where did you drive? To Whataburger. And you, made, and you knew that they was going to take forever. I ain't know that. Boy, yeah, it's water burger. Um, you got anything else you want to say? You, you supposed to be vlogging. Come on now. Go ahead. Tell them what's going on. I'm not a vlogger. Well, you need to get more comfortable. Go ahead. Excuse me. And we might go look at the atlas. Right? Uh-huh. You need to get more comfortable. Are you going to be in sales? You can't talk. This ain't sad. It's still talking. This ain't sad. So it's getting comfortable. <laughs> uh, all right, y'all. We're just like, what's good, y'all? So, what he was trying to explain was, <laughs> we are here about to do the third trimester, third trimester testing, like, you know, for like, you know, the blood work and the glucose test and all that stuff. So, my arm hurt. Yeah, that's what we about to do. We just put up to the hospital. And we want to go to um, the Volkswagen dealership just to look at the Atlas because that's what we want for our family car because our family four is not going to really fit in this sedan. Like, Everything is really not gonna fit in this today and although this is a cute car and we are definitely gonna keep it um, We want to get another vehicle And that would be the vehicle that we get So we want to see it in person see what it look like touch it feel it See the different cuts And everything And uh Yeah yeah, so I'm about to start this. They gave me the glute kit. It's a one hour GTT. I don't really know what that means. But ugh, I hate red anything. I really do. Like, and the fact that this is what. I just I hate red stuff I don't know why maybe we had too much Kool-Aid as kids <laughs> like I don't know like anything red I don't even like red red wine or nothing like that like if it's red I'm probably gonna pass just because it's red I don't know but yeah so oof. Yeah, let me let me do this. All right, about to start. Mm -hmm. All right, yes. <laughs> so eight thirty-three. Okay, we got ten minutes. What's good, y'all? What's good, y'all? Um, so y'all already know it's the next day. Y'all know how we roll. And the girls at Sam's Club because I need to pick up a few things for the house, and then I need to go to HEB. That's the thing about like our size family. Like we're not a very like we're about to be a family of four, clearly. But we're not like super super big that we need to get everything from Sam's Club. It's like 
I need to do a Sam's Club haul and then I need to do an H-E-B haul because certain things is unnecessary to get from Sam's Club because we don't go through it like that. And then certain things is unnecessary to get from H-E-B because we do go through it like that and it doesn't make sense, right? It won't last. So, I'm at Sam's Club first. Y'all, it's not even, even 10 o'clock in the morning. Um, I'm at Sam's and then I'm gonna go to H-E-B. I'm gonna get gas. It's just kind of a busy, busy, busy day. I'm gonna show y'all, take y'all along. I know I said that me and Bay was like going to go look at the um, the Atlas because that's what we want as our family car. You know, that's what we're working towards. But see, <laughs> that glucose test almost took your girl out. Like legit almost took me out. It is the worst the worst i y'all i was good for a minute you know i was good for a little minute and then we we really was teeter-tottering on that hour and i was like is this what a diabetic feel like before they fall out is this what this feels like because i wouldn't wish this on anybody at all like <sighs> my my followers that are diabetic like are y'all good y'all okay because if that's what that feels like i don't like that i don't like that but i do have my ob appointment on next week so she'll go over my labs and tell me you know if i passed da -da 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 -da, which i think i passed um but yeah your girl almost fell out like for real for real thank god thank god my husband was there because y'all wouldn't have made out i wouldn't have i couldn't even keep my eyes open like i had to go home and eat immediately like he gave me some toast and he made me some eggs and yeah i forgot to put eggs on all this let me put it on there now because i will forget y'all i will forget in a heartbeat Okay, so yeah, that's what we got going on. Um, traffic this morning, when I took Bailey to school, was actually like a little heavy, and I was like, what's going on? Like, even Bailey noticed it. She was like, mom, why is there so much traffic? And I was like, girl, I really don't know. But then when I got back to the apartment complex, I saw children waiting outside for the bus, and I was like, oh, they just went back, and Bailey been back for like over a week now. So, okay, cool. Didn't know that. Um, so that's why traffic was so much. Even taking Babe to work this morning, y'all, traffic was thick. And I'm like, cool. Um, we'll do better tomorrow. Cause now that we know, like Bailey, she's always gone gone to school, back to school earlier than the district we live in. That makes sense. I think that makes sense. So, yeah, I just can't believe my baby in second grade. Like, I'm about to have a second grader and a newborn. That's crazy. Y'all. Y'all. It's crazy. I, and first of all, I know I'm doing a lot of jibber jabber when I say I'm going to go in here in Sam's Club. And then we are going to go in Sam's Club. But I just want to apologize for the last week's vlog. Cause I know it's short. I know um, there weren't a whole lot of events going on. Yeah, last week felt like a recovery week. Cause first of all, we had so much going on the week before, and also it was just like a lot of like family stuff. That if you know, you know at this point, like how my family is. So it's almost like a blessing they live in a different state. It's just a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot, a lot. And I just could not wrap my mind around all of it. I was like, <laughs> oh my goodness, it's too much. It's too much. So it could be overwhelming. I'm dealing with all of them. When you get them elders together, baby. When you get them elders together, because. But yeah, let me hurry up. I need to get the ball rolling because I want to go home. I got 
stuff to do at home per usual oh yeah y'all we got the crib we got the crib and after i really like looked at it it's the same as that crib bailey had as a baby um which is like oh like sisters sisters <sighs> yeah but it's, it's the exact same crib like which is super cute. It did make the room, you know, our room smaller because the crib is in our room, but it's okay. It's just like a great feeling to be like, oh, my baby about to be here. Oh, I'm about to not get sleep, but my baby about to be here, y'all. Okay, let me stop talking. Let's, let's go on to Sam. okay because we just pulled up to H-E-B y'all saw I checked out of Sam's um I got what I could for the most part and now I'm gonna get what I need at H-E-B and then we're gonna go get gas and then we'll go home and put everything up and get it together because I'm already getting tired y'all it's only 10:32. I just, I can't be out here in that heat. Mm -mm. Not at my pregnant too. Mm -mm. I'm too pregnant for that. But things gotta get done and they gonna get done. They are gonna get done in the name of Jesus. So, let's do this. <sighs> yeah, I'm home and I'm so freaking tired. Like, I'm exhausted. Exhausted my feet. Baby, I really can't tell if they swollen or not. I don't think they swollen, but at this point, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if they were, but I want to show y'all a quick haul before I put everything up. <sighs> Ooh, okay. All right, so I'm gonna show y'all. Let's see, cause I don't feel like holding this camera. So I got the eggs from Sam's Club because we honestly go through a lot of eggs. So this is like a really good amount. Um, and they're actually way cheaper at Sam's. Like I think these, just one of them is like $4.50 or something like that. And if you go to HEB, you only get 12 eggs for like that price. So that's a deal. Then I got a hamburger not hamburger hot dog buns because i'm gonna make some of my song tiktok <laughs> and then i got some uh what is this called bread which is also cheaper at sam's like both of these was cheaper at sam's for what you got then babe requested these him and bailey love these i'm sure they're gonna be gone soon like there's 18 they finna kill those i got some Hamburger meat, ground beef, my freeze that. I got some Hawaiian rolls. I might end up making like some little sliders. We gonna see. 
Um, oh, also at Sam's, I got, so all that came from Sam's. Also from Sam's, I got the paper towels because we was out of paper towels. I got these, uh, these veggie puffs. It's open because I ate two already because I was hungry. And then we got the Mott's fruit snacks. That's from Sam's Club. And then from H-E-B, I got some bananas. A small thing of bananas. Whew, hold on, y'all. I need to reposition because your girl's tired. Wait, wait one second. Okay, y'all. I got it together. So, from H-E-B, I got three... Simply lemonade juices. I got some more which y'all know what this is. I use this when I make me loaf or really anything with ground beef, like my spaghetti and meatballs. Um if I make sliders or hamburgers, I definitely gotta add that. So I got two because we was out. So I got that. Then I got some cereal, some life cereal. I got crackers for Bailey. She really, those are her crackers that I always get that the price then went up significantly on. But we ain't gonna talk about it. Anyway, um, then I got some Velvia cheese because like I said, I saw this thing on TikTok and I'm gonna make it. And I got the Rotel, well, you know, the HB version of that. Got some more hot dogs because that's the whole part of the plan right there. I got two orange juices. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm out of breath. Okay, I got cheese and um, sandwich meat for Babe so he can make sandwiches for work. I got some yogurt, y'all. This is my favorite one, the peach one. My baby loves peaches. She absolutely loves peaches. So that's what I got. Um, I had got the big case from Sam's like a few weeks ago and it came with a bunch of flavors I did not care for <laughs> like cherry blueberry and all that the only one I really cared for was the peach so got peach I got some more gloves to wash dishes with as y'all know I don't I don't like using my hands well you know my bare hands like I showed y'all before the bananas I got this small pack of wipes just because, you know, y'all, flu season coming up. I need to start wiping down. <sighs> Sorry, I'm so out of breath. Okay. <sighs> okay, breathe. All right, I need to start wiping down, you know, door and handles, like phones, all that stuff. Because ain't nobody trying to get sick. I needed more prenatals, so I got those. We needed more lotion, y'all. You would be surprised. Hold on. You would be surprised what you go through, like a crazy amount of what you go through when you have a whole family. Like, it's insane. It's really insane. Like what we just constantly speed through. So this should last, honestly, probably a week and a half. I'm gonna be honest with y'all, it's not. But it's fine. It's a okay. Cause like I said, I know who I serve. I know who my God is, and He provides. Well, I didn't say that to y'all, but I've been saying that. Like when the enemy tries to bombard me with thoughts of, all right, Taryn, how's this gonna happen? How's that gonna happen? Like I literally say out loud, I know who I serve, Jehovah Jireh, and He provides, and He gonna figure out a way, and He gonna provide. Okay period like we're done like <laughs> Satan you must flee you must flee in the name of Jesus okay so if y'all watch I think her name is Peaches McIntyre I don't know but her name is Peaches here on YouTube and on TikTok and stuff I actually found her on TikTok but she's like on everything and she said in one of her videos I think it was like I'm gonna have a breakthrough. I'm not gonna have a breakdown. I'm gonna have a breakthrough. Period, sis. I'm gonna have a breakthrough, not a breakdown. So, excuse me if I try to put all this up, cause I'm tired. What's good, y'all? 
I don't even know what y'all seen last. This week has been, ooh. This week has been, oh my back hurt, hold on. This week has been low key non-productive. Excuse me. Because your girl just been tired. Ooh, excuse me. Zero energy. And I don't even have a whole lot today, to be honest with you. But this morning, I made a declaration. I was like, Lord, I'm gonna have energy today. I'm gonna get stuff done today. Cause I had mad dishes to wash. I still got mad laundry to fold. Um, I gotta take Bailey hair down and deep condition it and all this other stuff. Oh Lord, now I remember. Okay, I, I'll go get it. Side note, anyway, so right now, one of the things, first of all, I was gonna do all these things yesterday. Let me put that out there. I was. But then, but then your girl was like, just, I just couldn't, my body just could not. It was exhausted. To say the least, exhausted. So, nothing happened. I took a nap. Nothing happened. Nothing got clean. Nothing, nothing, nothing happened. Um, y'all hopefully y'all can hear me I know this air is loud but it's literally already 100 degrees and it's not even noon so it's hot but anyway yeah nothing happened I didn't get nothing done <sighs> yeah um I'm running a Dollar Tree I need to get a card for Shepherd's Day we're having Shepherd's Day at our church Sunday. Then I need to get the stuff to deep condition Bailey's hair because her hair has been braided up since the 30th or like the 26th. Whenever she went to her daddy's, I don't remember. But it's been braided up since then. And we are literally mid-August, so I need to take it down, deep condition it, cause she's gonna get her hair rebraided on the first yeah rebraided on the first so i need to do that because yeah we the baby shower baby shower is coming it's literally from today a week and a half yeah yeah right so basically we have this weekend and next weekend and it's the following weekend after that. If that makes sense. Anyway, point is, baby shower's almost here. Baby's almost here. We have less than 90 days before homegirl about to be born. Which is crazy to me. Like, less than 90 days. I'm about to be a mother of two, for real, for real. Which is amazing. I'm super excited, but I'm also, like, nervous. Because I'm finna have a newborn. And I don't feel very prepared. Like, it's a lot. It's really a lot. But yeah, so I need to do that. I need to do that. I need to go to the store. Cause y'all, we need. I just be trying to make everything stretch. I'm trying to make it stretch. The Lord been stretching me. And I'm trying to stretch everything else. Okay. So, I'm trying to make things stretch find cheap meals to make which I found some that hopefully will stretch throughout next week um, are they the healthiest probably not probably not the healthiest but will we be fed yes we will so that's what matters but um, what else I think that's kind of it like I said it's not noon yet it's already over 100 degrees I'm tired. So, yep. Hopefully I'm not too, too tired and I can get the vlog up today. I should have been edited. But like I said, y'all, this week was not productive for me. I've been asleep. I've been hibernating. I'm about to hit this third trimester. Hibernation has been 
that's just what I've been on, you know. So that's on that. Let's go into this uh, Dollar Tree.